This morning, you might be waking up to find a worrying email in your inbox. Ticketmaster says there's been a data breach, and if you were a customer, your credit card information may have been compromised. Ali Shisan joins us now from outside Scotiabank Arena. A lot of events held there, Ali. Should fans be concerned? Well, Dwight, while Ticketmaster gets to the bottom of this, they actually haven't said how many customers may have been affected by this. Could it be thousands? Could it have been millions? We just don't know. But either way, it's a good idea to be diligent. If you bought tickets through Ticketmaster between April 2nd and May 18th, that's when the company says an unauthorized third party accessed customer information. Information like personal data, credit card information, as well as uh, credit card expiry. So for its part, while it tries to get to the bottom of this, Ticketmaster says, quote, we have been diligently investigating this incident with the assistance of outside experts. We have also contacted and are cooperating with US federal law enforcement authorities. Ticketmaster is emailing affected customers uh, this morning and to learn more about what you should do if uh, your personal information has been exposed in this, we spoke to cybersecurity expert Jacques Sauvé. When we're talking about payment methods like credit cards and, and stuff like that, there's two things. The cyber bad guys will probably try to use that information themselves. More likely though, they will be sold online and forums on the dark web. Right, so you can go on the dark web and there's some forums where you can buy credit card numbers or buy lists of credit card numbers uh, and try to purchase goods or services with those credit card numbers. So credit card companies, however, are pretty darn good and have been for a very long time in uh, notifying users, customers that something unusual is happening uh, with the credit card. People out there are concerned about their credit card number floating around at this point. Well, the, your best bet is to just call the bank or credit card company, have the card canceled, and order a new one. All right. Well, Ali, who, who's to blame for the breach? Well, right now, Dwight, it seems to be uh, some finger pointing going on between Ticketmaster and the cloud software company that it works with to hold customer data. So it says that, or actually Sove suggests this theory, um, that Ticketmaster, they say the cloud company Snowflake uh, was breached. Um, that company denies this though. Sove tends to believe uh, them saying, uh, tends to believe them I should say, uh, saying that the, if the cloud company was actually hacked, then any other company that they have contracts with uh, would have also been reporting uh, breaches. But so far it's just Ticketmaster. Dwight. Interesting, thank you, Ali.